Hi, thank you for coming back to my channel. I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. Today I'm going to be doing a quick share of all the things that I picked up at the after Christmas sale. So let's get started. I was only able to hit two stores this year, Home Goods and Walmart. They were both having a 50% off sale and I think I got some good deals. So what I picked up from Home Goods were this pretty swag. I got two of them. They were originally $19.99. I got it for $9. And so since I have two, I think I may use these as part of a centerpiece. Next year, I could also put these over the door. They were just really pretty. I like the sparkly. And I thought the pine cones looked nice with the silver. So I got both of those. Also, those two reeves that you see um, in the back, that gold one there, it was originally $39.99, and I was able to get it for $18. And then the one on the right was $15, so it was originally $30. And so the one on the right, I'm thinking that I'm going to go ahead and use that for fall and maybe spring because it doesn't really feel very Christmas specific. So that'll definitely be a wreath that I'll get a lot more use out of. I'm thinking I can put a Hello Spring sign in the center or Hello Fall and hang that on the door and it'll work for multiple seasons. The next thing I got was this really pretty ballerina stocking. From my daughter I just thought this was so nice she's a little or I guess she's an angel she's not a ballerina um, and I liked her she's brown she's holding a star um, and it's really pretty this little dress part is nice and glittery this was originally ten dollars and I was able to get it for five I think this will be really nice so she'll have a special stocking for next year The next thing I picked up was this really beautiful marble soap uh, dispenser. I guess you could also use it for lotion. And it has this beautiful gold embossed reindeer. So you can see the little sparkle there. This was originally, hold on, let me find the price. I was able to find the price. This soap dispenser was originally $12.99, so I got it for $6.50. I did pick up two of these, um, because I think that's a really good deal for real marble. It's very heavy. Next, I did get this really pretty sparkly gold tree here with the star on top. This is also pretty heavy. This was originally $14.99, so $7.50. For this I think this will look nice on the mantle or maybe in the entryway on a console table if I buy one and then moving into cooking things I was able to pick up this cute little mini rolling pin with the, the spoon and the cookie cutters I like that it had the little baby version this is a cute little mini gingerbread and then the hearts. So this one, since this is a red set, I felt like this could really easily move into Valentine's Day, especially with the heart um, here. This was $7.99 originally, so I got it for $4. So I'll be using this definitely in February and then throughout the year. Next, I got these this whisk set. So just some basic red whisks here, but because it had the holiday patterned uh, backdrop it was considered Christmas so it got 50% uh, got marked 50% off so this was $3.99 originally so I got this for two dollars and then lastly I was able to get this cute little whisk and mini or sorry not whisk um, spatula and mini spatula set here um, this was four dollars and so I got it for two and I just thought this was really pretty. The, the little leopard with the Santa hat reminded me of something that anthropology would have because they usually have fun and unique things. So I was definitely happy to pick this up. Okay, so let's go ahead and move into Walmart. From Walmart, I picked up this really nice tree topper. It was $4.88 originally, so I got it for $2.44. I also picked up these kitchen towels. I had to go to a different Walmart that was a little out of the way. These were originally 97 cents and so they were 47 cents. 
for these. So there was this nutcracker that says nutty or nice. And then there was the nutcracker that has the pink trees and pink candy canes and the drums. And these are really cute, thin little towels that you can use for anything. That was a good deal. I picked up a few of each style. Next, I was able to pick up this Cuisinart pot holder and towel set. What I liked, this was the only one they had left. And what I liked about it was that it has a little gingerbread design. And on the back is just this nice checker pattern. And then the towel itself just says Baking Spirits Bright. So this is going to be really, really fun and nice to use. And this is actual glitter around here. So we'll see if that ends up coming off. <laughs> so be careful if you are going to use this for cookies or something. Next, I did get another one of those little village houses. If you saw my other haul uh, video, then you'll, you'll see that I had a little small obsession with these cardboard village houses. This was originally $14.98, so again, $7.50. And this was the last one that they had. It lights up. Mine needs new batteries, but uh, it lights up, and I think it's really nice. I'm trying to give you... A full view of it here in case you're interested in any of these and it's a really good size for $7.50 the smaller ones that I got from the 99 cent store from the previous haul were four dollars and they were a lot smaller than this I also found this peace on earth sign here and I really like it because it looks kind of nativity scene ish and I feel like I don't have enough Christmas signs. Well, I don't really have any Christmas signs. So this was originally $4.98. So $2.50 for a pretty large sign, I think, is definitely a win. Behind that, I did pick up this 300 count clear mini lights. And I don't remember how much this was. I want to say I only paid two or three dollars for this so that was gonna be a good that's a good deal just to always have lights next to the last thing I was able to find this huge or not huge but this large 50 shatterproof ornaments and I thought this blue and gold was such a nice vibe so this may be the color scheme for next year because I really love how this looks this was originally $17.88, and so again, half off for that. And then the last couple of things from Walmart were just pajama sets. So I got myself this coral colored one with the uh, leopard print on the back, or on the pants, and the blue with, I don't know, is this like an argyle sweater? Is that what they call this? Whatever this print is on the back. So these two were great. They were originally $10 each, so they were $5 each. So that was a good deal. And then I got one more thing from Home Goods that I'm going to show you. One thing I missed mentioning from Walmart was this joy sign. The joy lights up. And on the, the Walmart site, it says this was $12.98. So I must have paid $6.50 for this. I really think it's pretty. I like the red and I like the floral. It's it's a Pioneer Woman style. That's really nice. I also was able to uh, look at the price of this. I didn't think I gave you the price. It was $6.88 for this set. And the lights were $4.14. Okay, so then the last thing that I got from Home Goods was this four-foot pre-lit tree. Okay, sorry about that. I took a quick break to get the baby a snack. But this is the tree that I picked up from Home Goods. It was $50. It's a four foot pre lit tree. And what I really like about this tree is that it has these little gold frosted tips here. And the pine cones are also kind of frosted with this gold glitter. And what I'm thinking about doing with this tree is using it in the entryway or the front porch area. I have a covered front porch and I think this may fit 
right by the door. I'm hoping it does, so that's my goal. Thank you so much for watching my after Christmas haul. I pray that all of you have a safe and healthy holiday, and I'll see you next time. Bye.